Good morning, class. Now I'm going to show you how to use this class rate calculator to find back the Z value. Eh? How to use this calculator to find back the Z value or standard score. So at first, look at first example. PZ less than Z. So we need to find the Z value here. So how to find this Z value? This is probability value. So we try to draw out the diagram. So your diagram will be 0. Point 0 0.2 at 29 at 1 this one is the probability value so you need to imagine one bell curve shape is one probability is one so meaning that half of it will be 0 0.5 so this one is less than half so less than half you need to imagine if the shape is less than half shape is less than half and then the area less than half and then you have this less than symbol meaning that your area go to that side so less than half area go to that side so meaning that like this so this is the z value that we have the region here is 0 0.29 at 1 how we are going to get this so you need to know that to use the mod this mod inverse mod you need to make sure the region that you have is left tail so left tail left tail how we're going to get left tail only two two uh, two pattern either like this or like this so left hand side we consider we can get straight away from the calculator eh? so let this question i can get it already so i go to mod distribution seven and then i press inverse normal number three so i just key in the area zero point two nine at one so key in calculator get the answer negative zero point 529 something you see the final answer actually is negative 0 0.53 so i can get an answer from here and then look at second question same thing also we try to draw so the region area here more than half so we need to know the area cover more than half and then less than area go to that side so cover more than half go to this side so this one is the diagram so 0 0.8340 so this region like this ah. Huh? so it's this pattern right so i can use key in straight away so i just key in just key in go to mod just now eh? go to key in the area is zero point at three four zero straight away get the answer so answer is 0 0.97 something so this is the real answer and then similarly for this question so you need to draw so now it's greater than go this side the region and then the region cover more than half bell so if cover more than half bell uh, go to this side greater than so meaning that your z value is negative value eh? so from here the z value is negative value so this area is 0 0.94 at 2 so just now i said when you want to use this calculator to find the inverse the region must be go to left side like this or like this right so you see this one is go to right side so we need to do some modification to get the area at the left hand side so area at the left hand side is this one so we straight away use 1 minus 0 0.94 at 2 so we key in 1 minus 1 minus 0 0.94 at 2 so get the answer straight away negative 1.62 at something and then for this region also the same you see this one area cover less than half so meaning that less than half bell go to right hand side so this one actually is a positive value positive z value so 0 0.1056 so to get this region and uh, this region is 0 0.1056 so to get the z value we need to have the tail like this left hand side like this or like this so we need to do some modification for this part so how you modify again need to use this green color so how to get this green color just key in 1 minus 0 0.1056 so key in in the calculator 1 minus 0 0.1056 equal then you get the answer is 1.250 something like this so in short uh, by using this calculator to find the inverse, to find the Z value, if given probability value, to find the Z value, you need to make sure that the region that you have is at left side, like this or like this.
Okay, let's say if you don't have this type of region, just like question 3 and question 4, so what you need to do is you just key in 1 minus 1 minus to get the left side region. Key in like this, then you get the answer. Huh?